Indiana University, home of students, athletes, and artists of all backgrounds. Here in these hallowed halls, students of all kind can come to study what they have a passion for. One passion that has a large impact on the life of students here at IU is the arts. I am a member of the Singing Hoosiers and I have been since my freshman year of, high, of college. <laughs> Um, I've always been in show choir. I've always been interested in jazz. So I actually ended up going to a camp here in high school that was a vocal jazz camp back when Steve Zagree was still alive and he was a professor at IU that taught vocal jazz performance. And he was also the leader of the Singing Hoosiers. And when I went, he said, if you come to IU, you should look into the Singing Hoosiers. So I did. I think being a part of any important group whether it be important to you or important to other people, gives you a family. And I think having your own family on campus is very important. One thing about the Singing Hoosiers that's different about other groups is that it's not just music majors. It's a lot of, like we have some nursing majors and then I'm a media major and I have friends who are um, music majors and then I have, I have a human bio major I sit next to. It's just, there's all kinds of different majors within the group. So I think taking a common interest amongst multiple different types of people interested in multiple different types of things um, gives us a, I hate to say advantage, but we're more diverse than just the music groups that are all music students. Okay, so I'm a theater minor here at IU, and it's really great. The theater program here is really great, and so I knew I wanted to be involved in some way. Um, and I didn't want it to be my major because I wanted to major in media, and I wanted to take some more elective courses in some other departments, so I knew I didn't have time to do two majors. So I decided to take on theater as a minor, and it's been really great because I've got to meet a lot of people in the department, and I've got to work on them and with, work with them in some shows. Well, I was, it was a big toss-up for me during my like junior and senior year of um, high school. I didn't know if I wanted to do theater or if I wanted to do something more related to journalism. Um, so I started looking at schools that had good programs in both, and IU was one of them, which is why I'm here. But I, even coming to IU, I was still kind of uncertain whether I wanted to do something more theater-related or more journalism-related. Um, I'm not really pursuing acting. For me, it's more of a hobby right now because um, it's not my it's not like my major. It's not my career path. So the thing that's really cool about acting classes and theater classes is that you're put out of your comfort zone every single day when you walk into the classroom and you just have to get up there and you kind of embarrass yourself every day, but it's really fun. You get to do it together. And I think that's how people come together, um, just kind of with shared experiences. And that's what acting has given me my whole life. And so that's why I like it as a hobby, especially like when I'm in a show, that moment, like when the lights go out and the audience gets quiet and like the show is right about to start, like that is like the best moment. Even if like I'm not in the first scene or whatever, like that's just the best moment because you can like feel all the anticipation and you see that like all your hard work is about to like pay off um, and you know, you're just about to do this wonderful thing with all these people. And so that's been a really like motivating thing for me. Like I look forward to that moment. And so it's, it's helped me to like work really hard throughout the semester. If I'm in a show, like I know that it's gonna take up a lot of my time. So I have to work harder at, like with my classes to make sure that I'm like keeping up, but still having fun at rehearsal and still working hard in everything that I'm doing. I think what's great is that there's always something arts related going on, whether it's through the Jacobs School of Music or the theater department or the fine arts department. Um, there's just always something happening. And so on the weekends, it's really easy to go to and see a show or go to the auditorium and watch like a musical or go and see an art gallery and or do something related to art. But it's just, it's been really nice to be in such a welcoming environment for the arts because I think we need more of that. I think it helps people like allow themselves to be creative and really just go out there and be unique. I think that's important for any career to stand out and I think the arts really impact people positively in that way.